Business owners on Maple Avenue are frustrated about a Dallas plan to reduce the number of traffic lanes on a major thoroughfare from four lanes to two lanes. The change would be on Maple Avenue between Mockingbird and Oak Lawn Avenues. Fox 4's Lori Brown, live at Reverchon Park with more on this story. Lori. Steve, while traffic lanes would be reduced from four to two on Maple Avenue, there would be a turning lane added along with a bike lane in each direction. And it's really going to hurt business. Martin Guajardo, manager at Avila, says cutting the number of traffic lanes in half on Maple Avenue could create traffic jams that will drive away his customers. A lot of our business comes from the medical district, downtown, um, Oaklawn Heights. They have very limited time to come and eat, you know, an hour usually, and they're going to be stuck in traffic for 30 minutes of that. It's really going to hurt businesses, and a lot of these businesses, are, they're all mom and pops. Most are mom and pops. The city says it is proposing the changes to make Maple Avenue safer. According to a city presentation, Maple Avenue between Hudnall and Oak Lawn tops the list of city streets with fatal or severe injury crashes involving pedestrians. But the city's data is lacking a lot of specifics, like a time frame or numbers of crashes. Guajardo says the businesses here are geared to drivers, not pedestrians. Yeah, they're not going to walk with bags full of groceries from the grocery store down the street. They're not going to carry their laundry baskets and walk to the laundromat. They're going to be driving, mm -hmm. and it's going to be restricting access to all these businesses up and down, um, up and down Maple. And what is frustrating a lot of business owners is that the city never notified them about the proposed changes, and they are only just now finding out about it, two and a half months after the deadline for public comment. We didn't know anything about it. Jorge Garza lives in the area and he says he's been asking the city to do something to make Maple Avenue safer. Okay. More people are going to die. Garza says crossing Maple Avenue is next to impossible. He has the best chicken uh, tacos that I can find in town and I cannot walk to this six blocks because my, my wife and I come down Hondo and we come across there are at least three intersections where we're not safe. He says if changes are made it will improve not only safety but the quality of life. Life will become much better on Maple Avenue for a period of time and then we'll need an upgrade. But business owners see it differently. Maple hasn't been a two-way two-lane road for 60 years uh, I don't know why we want to go backwards like that. Um, it's really going to affect business. A public meeting between stakeholders and city leaders has been going on since 5 o'clock and it is wrapping up right now. Construction on this project was set to start in about a year. Steve, okay. Heather? All right, Lori Brown, thank you.